What's up, everybody? Welcome to Polk County, Florida. We're in Lakeland, mm -hmm. where they're selling golden doodle, do, golden do, doodle. Yeah. What type is a golden doodle? It's a crossbreed of a golden retriever and a poodle. What is a golden retriever? Does it like retreat? Retriever. You said retriever, not retriever. You said well, whatever. It's well, no, it's not. Retriever. No, there's a, there's a difference between retreating and retrieving. Okay, a retreater. <laughs> Like fleas, it runs away. <laughs> it's scared and leaves. And a retriever brings back something. There's definitely, there's definitely a huge difference between retreating and retrieving, Katie. It's not, no, it's not the same thing. It's not a golden retriever. That's definitely not the dog you want. It's like we had somebody break in the other house, and our dog ran away. <laughs> oh, bless their heart. Welcome to Poe County, the safest place in America. Everybody knows this is the safest place in America. And we're gonna show you what the neighborhoods, the best neighborhoods of Lakeland look like. Uh, of course, the best place in America. You're gonna feel safe. And there's gonna be no type there's of- There's an ATV store right there. Dude, I know. Uh, this is the safest place in America, y'all. In this video, we're gonna see why Polk County is the safest place in America. Yeah. If it was up to me, I'd be at that uh, store over there, but you know, we gotta keep keep on track. The ATV store? Yeah. I don't even know how we can look at it. Is that a dunk? Oh, snap. Oh, he's got orange rims. He's got orange rims. And he doesn't have to worry about nobody stealing them. <laughs> can you go on? I guess you can go, right? Yeah, oh. Th this is the safest place on earth. Like, Polk County, like, it's safe. Like, in Lakeland, it's, it's the safest place in Polk County. Mm -hmm. um, so, I think we could just roam around this whole area. I think we'll be fine. We don't have to worry about Do our Do you want safety. to get out of the car and walk? <sighs> no, we're, we're standing there. Okay. Yeah, we'll just, I'm pretty sure this is the safest place in America. So, like, you don't have to worry about nothing. This, oh, no. this place is safe. I'm good. We're gonna be safe over here in Polk County. Mm -hmm. You can breathe. Let me just. Oh, yeah, you can finally <laughs> breathe. Yeah. Polk County. You know why it's called Poke? Because they're poking. They poke, you know. Yeah, we'll be alright. Yellow line one. The bus is clearly orange. But it's a yellow one. It's clearly orange. Nice people don't know the difference. Da, 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 da. All the leaves are brown. And it's right at night. And night, and night. Is it like houses where they get those brown spots and now the bus is orange because it got rain on? Why would you need metal bar? Oh, somebody just got whacked there? There's like teddy bears by the corner. school. What the crap? You know, they have metal bars on the windows over here. That's kind of strange. Yeah. And why would you need metal bars on your windows if you live in a safe neighborhood, right? I'll tell you, yeah. yeah. That's strange. Uh, that's not something I'd expect to see in Polk County. No. It's still that car's car like a converter. It's like, whoa. Ah. Oh. What's going on here? This is what we see every time we oh, come to this been, town. Yeah, yeah, I remember this person. I'm sorry, are we back in Alabama or something? I don't know. I, I think this is where they came from. This is where Alabama originated. Yeah. No hope in dope. No parking, you'll get towed away. <laughs> Why would you need a no hope and dope sign if you live in a safe place? No parking, place? but Jesus loves you. <laughs> Jesus loves you, but I don't. Yeah. Park here, you're getting towed. Yeah. Hmm. Orange rock right there. Yeah, <laughs> when like an old, old bulldozer. What's up with all these no trespassing and warning signs? Wouldn't you think that the safest place in America wouldn't have a need for a no trespassing sign? I don't know. Oh, 
them hurts me. Da 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 da. All the. Oh my gosh! Did I just almost say that? What? <laughs> well, I just caught myself singing something horrible. <laughs> All the leaves, I was gonna, you know, the song's called All the Leaves Are Brown. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm trying to make a song about the hoods, and I almost. <laughs> Go, boy! <laughs> I can't believe I almost said that. Oh my god. Like, I almost said it, and I'm like, wait, hold on, my dick. That doesn't sound right. Why is this house facing like. They built the house Why sideways. is there no paint on the house? Well, not only that, forget about painting it. It's not facing the road, it's like facing the side. Well, and then over there, they could figure out what color uh, this house plywood metal they bars. wanted. Yeah. This house has metal bars on the windows. Why would you need metal bars on the windows if you live in Polk County? It's a safe place. I know. There's a hump on the road. Why would you need a hump on the road if it's safe? You would just assume yeah. people would drive slowly but I and have a bump. New house going in. Kind of small. Mm-hmm. That's about the house I want to build. Yeah. Except for a longer porch. Yeah, the, turning the All the Leaves Were Brown song into a, a hood song. That yeah, that does not work. What, what at happened all? to this house? I'm what sorry. are you advertising here? For, no trans, no dumping, and then there's like a tire in front of the no dumping sign. Come on, Polk County. You can do better than that. No dumping sign, oh, and somebody this. dumped a tire. What is going on? Coronavirus? What is go uh, no money? <laughs> Keep out. I'm Save to, the children. I'm trying to figure out. Uh, 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 I think you. Uh, what is going on in this neighborhood? This neighborhood is wacky, bro. Big mulberry tree. Well, they're clearly friends with people in the front. All oh, the leaves are brown. Da, da, da. I guess there's no turning into a hood song. It's, it's not going to happen. No. Wow. That was. You know, I usually start singing a song that's on, just stuck to my head. Yeah. And then I'll cater it to where we're at. But yeah, you can't. It don't song, fit. That, it that, doesn't that fit the bill here. Yeah. That song. Yeah. And then I caught myself for actually. Oh my. Like, <laughs> I was like, oh the. <laughs> I was like, like, I can't say that. And before you say something, I'm queuing, so shut up. There's always somebody like you're dirty, dirty. I'm dirty too, stupid. I'm fixing this one. Yeah, that's not good. Now I'm gonna be. There's metal bars on both of these houses on both sides of the road. Why would you need metal bars if you live in the safest place in the world? This one's got metal bars right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. More than tire dumping over here. That's always good. There's like a three-plex right there. Hello? This one's got metal bars on the windows right here. It's on the left. Yeah. Why would you need metal bars? On? It must be for decoration. I, I guess. Yeah, it must be for decoration. Because I don't think Polk County is a thing. Ooh, is that a Buick? I'm dying to get my hands on a little Buick. I'm dying to get my hands on a pool. <laughs> Like our goals in life are, I'm more like, I want a Buick underneath an oak tree. You're like, I want a pool. I want a pool underneath an oak tree. They're building houses out here. <laughs> See, I would want a house like these with a bigger porch. Uh -huh. Ooh, and a one-car garage on the other side. That, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that works. Oh, the leaves oh, look, are it. You can make your own. Make your own tequila. Mm -hmm. And you can have the... Empty tequila lot. lime shrimp. Empty lot, but they've had to put a fence around it. Or chicken, which is my favorite. Hmm, why would you need an eight foot fence for an empty lot? Hmm. I just don't understand. I thought this was the safest place in the world. Yeah. All oh, the leaves are burned. That one's got metal bars right there. Look okay. at trampoline. Two trashy things. Metal bars, oh. trampoline. I'll probably mow half their lawn. Mm -hmm. Mom was like, I don't want to work today. Hmm. Let's explore more of the city. There's got to be a better yes. side to it. This this can't be all of it. This got to be the better part to the city. Oh, the leaves are brown. Da 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 da. California leaving. 
gotta be like a half day today. California leaving down there. <laughs> and on California leaving to a better place. safest place in America have good internet signal. Mm -hmm. All the people are moving out of town. California leaving for a better time. Okay, dump truck. If you know, if you know the road's blocked, why are you moving? You can't block the intersection. I wish you would, bro. I wish you would. You know you can't block the intersection, so why are you moving forward? Finally, 1%. Oh, the people up by South, man. The people up by South, I said it. California leaving for a better time. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. I know a good neighborhood when I see it. Oh, yeah. You think they could air Mad TV nowadays? Probably not. Probably not. Mad TV, like, you couldn't air it today. Even some old SNL. Oh, it's crazy. It's like, we used to watch that, and you thought it was okay, but now today, you watch it. Even I felt offended about it. I watched at Mad TV recently. And I was like, wow, that's offensive. But when I used to watch it back then, I thought it was funny. Look at South Park. Interesting, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, they've always been weird. Yeah. And I don't like South Park. What? I don't like South Park. The only thing I ever liked about South Park was a skit where Cartman wanted to eat a cow. He was like, yeah, yeah, man. And then that's about it. Are we in a medical center? Why oh, they look back? Look back at it. Look back at it. Yeah, ain't nothing but a boop ba ba ba. A boop ba ba ba. A boop ba ba. Wepa, wepa, wepa. Ah, wepa, wepa, wapa. Ah, achando do Brasil. Oh, you hocked the horn if it's not dangerous, everybody. <laughs> they hocked the horn, you hocked the horn. It's the rules of life. Can I see my perfect? Wow, there really is no singing here. It took me 10 minutes of this video to get 1%. Oh, why are we turning the north here? I don't know. You're driving. Well, you're not helping. Are you mad at me? Don't be mad at me. Uh, let's go to the next town, anyways. Unfortunately, we have to film this town more. Relaxing? 
I can tell you I won't be relaxing there. The only thing that's probably relaxing there is probably a bed bug. <laughs> bed bugs. I got plenty of food. I got plenty of food to eat here. Two mm percent. -hmm. Oh. Wow. Wow, man. Eight hours remaining. Yeah. 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 Some people always nurses walking. Mm -hmm. By the way, nurses are supposed to be like very healthy and good looking, and they're all like morbidly obese. Mm -hmm. Can I see my print? I just forgot where the grabber on. <sighs> what is it called? Lake Shore. Oh, I see. Looks like a giant lake that breaks the town apart. There's a Circle K inside of the residential committee. Those are always good. I gotta see that one. Uh, Head north on Lakeland Hills Circle. Boulevard toward East Bella Vista la, Street. La, 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 la. Continue on Lakeland Hills Boulevard for one mile. Ain't nothing but a boo ba 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 a boo ba ba a boo ba ba P.D. Osbrick Associates of Lakeland. I got plenty of money. I got plenty of money. Oh, man. I got plenty of money. statue for Bill Cosby. Why? Good TV show. What? Florida towns do all types of weird things. Wasn't there a guy playing, tossing a baton in the air when we got off the exit on Planet City? Yeah. Yeah, well, Florida, like, they just do weird things. What's up? <laughs> and the wall, with, they have, like, a wall, and then they have, like, electrical wire on top of the wall. <laughs> That's is insane. That chair? No, what is that? What, 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 what is in there that you need that? Why would the sheriff's office need to have that? What's back there? It's a post office. A post office needs all that? Dude, why would you need all that in the safest place in America? I don't know. Dude, that is like so ghetto. Look at that. They have like a, they have like a wall, and then on top of the wall, they have like, like barbed wire fences and stuff. And then you got apartments right next to it. Yeah, of course. They actually look nice. Fenced in. Yeah. <laughs> All apartments are Princeton nowadays, though. Really? Yeah. Those are pretty pun. Pretty pun, pretty pun, pretty pun, pretty pun, pretty pun. Oh, I made up a new word, pretty pun. Pretty pun. <laughs> I don't put upon and I put it upon. Let's see here. Oh, I was supposed to go one block ahead to get to this. I'm going around, it's not big deal. Why would you need a six foot fence with a barbed wire line around the top if it's the safest place in the world. You think maybe we've been lied to? Oh, come on, dude, go. Maybe it's not the safest place in the world. Oh, no, her. place to do it. <sighs> Safest place in the park. Even though people have six foot fences with bob wire on top of it. <laughs> well, 
Well, it's like you, you heard the Lee County Sheriff was where we live in Fort Myers mm -hmm. was bragging about um, the Lee County Sheriff was bragging about how Lee County is not one of the safest people, places, whatever. It's now the They've world. had five people whacked in the last two weeks. Yep. Stupid. You know, hey, we're the safest county in the world. Five days later, five people drop. Yep. Unbelievable. I was kind of a uh, premature there. He said he was on the internet bragging about how Lee County is the safest place in America. We live in the safest place in America. Five people have been have dropped in Fort Myers. Well, we're definitely not on the safest place list anymore. No, that's all it took, yeah. Dude. A bourbon on bows. Stop. On them Cadillac rims too. Fresher than a mint leaf. Mm -hmm. You you do start to see like deep south stuff once you get to Polk County. It's kind of like yeah. deep south. You get to see all the things you'll see in the deep south: fried food, big wheels, high crime, mm -hmm. bed bugs. Mm -hmm. My leg hurts. I'll tell you one thing about this Camry. It might get 40 miles to the gallon, but you're gonna, your legs are gonna hurt, your back's gonna hurt, your spine's gonna hurt. You might, you might have saved forty thousand dollars in gas for the car's lifetime, but you're gonna need a hundred thousand dollars in back surgery by the time you're done running around. By the time you drive a hundred thousand miles in this car, you're gonna need a whole new back. Forget about how much money you saved on gas. You're gonna need a whole new back. Man, you see those are uncomfortable. It's just a poorly designed vehicle. I think when they design these cars, they're not thinking about 800 pound Americans like me and Katie. They're thinking about like, you know, like they're thinking about, I don't know. I think what they need to do, I think, you know what Toyota needs to do? They need to pay me and you to go to Japan and they can study like the physical impacts. Like, like stick me and you, like Toyota should pay me and you to go to Japan mm -hmm. and like drive around their cars. And like just like give us like back surgeries and, and, and like x-rays of our back after being in, in the car for 14 hours and be like oh hey guess guy guys you should realize americans are five times heavier than a japanese person <laughs> like they really weren't thinking about me and kenny when they built these cars my back hurts my leg hurts my knee hurts the last spinal cord bone down there hurts like for lack of a better word I'm not uncomfortable from the car, so even if I was unco I'm uncomfortable for other reasons. So I mean, even if I was uncomfortable within the car, Dude, my like leg, I wouldn't I notice it. I literally need to park for two seconds just to stretch my legs. Yeah. They were definitely not thinking about Americans when they no. bought these cars. They were thinking about like tiny Japanese people. Yeah. Around. There's no way when they built this car, they, the engineers were like, maybe a 400 pound American's gonna buy this car. Yeah. Dude, everything hurts. Give me a second, y'all. So there's a Circle K in a residential neighborhood. That's always interesting. Mm -hmm. Mall homes across the street. Do you need to like adjust your seat or something? There's nothing you, I, I've tried everything. Did you try the little knobby thing? Is there a knob? Yeah, the little fluffy thing that makes it fluffy. What's that doing? It makes your seat more fluffy if you need it. Like firmer. Yeah. It only has two positions. And I think firmer would probably be the better one. There's a knob. So it's got more than two. And it gets fluffy. Oh, dude, this is so uncomfortable. Well, fix your seat. Well, don't tell me to fix it. You fix it. I'm comfortable. I'm not comfortable. Where are we going to next? There's a, I'm gonna go to this place called Juanita. I heard that's really hood Juanita. Mm -hmm. Juanita? How do you spell this thing? Wagner, South Carolina. Juan, Juanita. Let's see what it is. Uh, 40 minutes away from it? Where is it by? Is there a place? You have to like literally drive to the whole city of Lakeland. Oh, yes. 
and then threw Auburn down. So we might as well do Winter Haven the and then go there. Yeah, and then we can head back. To Polk City. I definitely want to go Polk City. <laughs> I could just go to. I want to go to um, Jacksonville. Keep traveling to Jacksonville. How far are we from Jacksonville? GPS. Uh, give me a yeah. GPS Jacksonville. No, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, <laughs> no, 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 yeah. <laughs> I love how we go on a road trip. We have like no idea where the crap we're going. Uh, we know we're going somewhere. We just don't I know. I thought we were heading somewhere else today. We could do that, or we could go to Jacksonville. It doesn't matter to me. I think where we mess up is we got to publish one video a day, and that's it. Like I get excited when I like get on the road, and I want to publish like every video we've made. Three and a half hours. Oh, I almost ran the kid over. Okay, I'm sorry, bro. Mm -hmm. Alabama license plates. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Got that Bama right there. We could be there in three and a half hours. And then what time is it? One? Mm -hmm. So by four o'clock we can be in Jacksonville. That gives us time to record and everything. Yeah. Hmm. And one, one hour of it will be driving to Orlando. Mm -hmm. Which is always a good radio. Especially this time of year. But I know our rental videos didn't do a lot of great last time. Our rental videos didn't do a lot of great last time. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. All the Alabama people. Ran me out of town. You can tell they're from Alabama because they have. A truck that looks like that. <laughs> Surprised it's not squatted. All the leaves are brown. <laughs> Isn't that kid be in school? Um, I've been noticing it's probably an early release. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm already early release, though. We haven't seen enough Florida men while we've been here. I think Florida men's been like. I came to the Florida Man headquarters to make sure I could see Juanita the Florida Pearl. Man. Juanita Pearl. <laughs> Juanita La Perla. That sounds like a hooker's name. Juanita Pearl. <laughs> Juanita La Perla. <laughs> oh, dude, this is like Florida Man headquarters back here. Oh, my gosh. Why? <laughs> this is like the Florida Man headquarters. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know what turn. Ow! But what did you do? Well, there's the roads, like, the yeah. concrete's broken, so, like, when your car, the weight shifts it. Yeah. Why do you need two window shakers? Mm -hmm. I'll make a great cover for This is, like, the Florida Man headquarters on here. Mm -hmm. Yes, when my car gets hurt, it physically hurts me. Like I got shocked by something. Katie's always like, "How does that hurt you?" I'm like, "How does it not yeah. physically hurt me?" There's yeah. like graffiti on the stop sign. This is like four minute headquarters out here. Mm -hmm. I've never felt more uncomfortable for the safety of a shot. <laughs> yeah, I've never, I've never been so concerned for a shot safety. This is like Florida Man Olympics out here, bro. What is this place? 12 Oaks? Mm -hmm. 12 Pipes, Mobile Home Park. <laughs> that ain't right. <laughs> you know that ain't right. You gotta turn. 12 Pikes, 12 Pipes, Mobile Home Park. Yeah. <laughs> that ain't right. Yeah. 12 Pipes, 12 Pipes, Mobile Home Park. <laughs> <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> Here's 12 oaks, 12 pipes. <laughs> well, that one might have been. I mean, there's so much. Look, look at these, look at these mobile homes. They're like, like look baby. Look to the right. Of it. Oh, well, that pressure washer does a good job, though. But it looks like it got burnt. Dude, that's like the smallest. It's a duplex mobile home. What the crap? Mm -hmm. Yo, yo, yo! That's a duplex mobile home. Mm -hmm. That's like Lehigh meets North Fort Myers right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's okay to be poor though. It really is. But there's nothing wrong with being poor. Now, if you have a family, you got kids, you can't be poor. You gotta give your family the best you can. If you're a single guy and you're poor, it's cool. Mm -hmm. No, 
If you got kids and family, you can't be poor. Your kids need to go to good schools, good uniforms, a little bit of savings for an emergency. If you're a single guy, and you decide you want to be poor and not put any effort into life, that's cool. Yeah. But if you want, I mean, once you got a wife and kids, like, you can't be poor. At that point, now you got to say, okay, I, I, maybe I don't need a job, I need a career. Maybe after working a 50-hour week, you might have to study for 10 more hours. You know, pick up a real estate book or some type of course or something. You know, life puts you in different situations and then requires different things from different people. Some people don't have to train. But if, like, you got kids and stuff, maybe it's time for you to try. like a miniature of North Fort Myers. The no foe yo yo. No foe, no foe. The no foe and the pole. The no pole. Right here. This is, this is the, you know, we got the no foe. This is the no pole. No poles. The no pole. I love the elevation here. <laughs> I told her that in Florida. It's a mountain yeah. right there. And a mountain. Florida mountain. Florida mountain. Florida mama. Mm -hmm. Okay, I really wanted to do um, one that on all that, but it's a 40 minute drive. Hmm. Should we do we and a haven on the way, then do that, and it would take the time out? Hmm. Scrotum Loop Road. I'm blind. What'd so you say? Cool. Oh, so cool. I'm blind. And that's a beautiful butterfly. Okay, let's go to. Um, do we do Jacksonville or do we do. Uh, what do we do? I thought we were going to go back for a few days and then go back out. I love that Toyota. What are, what's a hotel we like in Jacksonville looking like? Uh, I've been missing Jacksonville. Jacksonville's a good money making city for us. Jacksonville. Jacksonville's never let us down other than getting yeah. shot at or something. But like, beyond that. <laughs> <laughs> There's always excitement in Jacksonville. cheaper hotel we stayed at was pretty much Tiger Town. This is where the Tigers Detroit the Tigers have their spring training <laughs> in Lake City, Florida. <laughs> Not Lake City. Lake we, Lake. <laughs> we got the worst team on earth. We got the Wherever worst. Wherever we're at, no. you're sleeping in the car tonight. Okay, first of all, it's the worst sport in America because nobody cares about baseball anymore. The worst sport and the worst team. It's like, we're on crap. Detroit Tigers suck. Ah! Now, the Cincinnati uh, ba ba Bagels, what are they called? The Cincinnati Bagels? What's the team from Cincinnati called? I don't know. The, ba the Cincinnati Bagels. Now, that's a, that's a baseball team right there. Let me get a O H I O O. Let me get a O H I O Ohio. 
The Detroit Tigers suck, dude. You know they do. The Detroit Tigers is like the worst baseball team that's ever existed. And don't get me started on the Lions. <laughs> Hang on, flying down there. <laughs> Throw it down there, like dang you know, baseball, nope, football, nope. Dang you know, worst team. Yeah. What's wrong, baby? What happened to the kitty? Oh, I have no kitty, Dad. Oh no, baby, it just needs to see a doctor. He'll make it. It wasn't moving. No, it's just relaxing. Just sorry, baby, my sound the road. You care about cats? Pretty. I hate cats. I don't like most cats. I don't like the way they behave. Pretty. I don't like the way they behave. They're sneaky. If it was a dog, I would be traumatized. But a cat? Dude, look at how bad that wheel is. It's like, look how bad the wheels are on that thing. Mm -hmm. Look, compare the front. The wheels are like all like messed up. Go get an alignment. And the alignment's not going to fix that. What? It's going to take more than an alignment to fix that. It's going to take like, you notice how the front wheel on the, on, on the right side? Oh, it's like one inch off. You need some like suspension. I, I don't know what you need. He needs but to you repent. Need That's what he needs to do. <laughs> that thing is horrible. On the front side, the front, the front left tire. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I know you're from Michigan and all, but let's be. And then you were born in the Detroit area, but they can't play baseball. They can't get, Katie, get back in the car, Katie, Katie. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Hey, Katie, get back in the car. We gotta leave. I'm right here. I never left, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> you called me an idiot. <laughs> you called me. One day, some weirdo's gonna actually get in our car. <laughs> or scratch him. I end up with like, oh, this car can't handle two Katie's. <laughs> Got four cylinders in the thing. Oh, I'm all baby. Um, okay, I'm, I'm being a very insensitive jerk. I'm sorry. I'll buy you ice cream. Well, you shouldn't be eating ice cream. I'll, I'll buy you a salad. Dude, don't you know I'm lactose intolerant now? <laughs> I'm sorry. Ow! Don't bite me! So now I have evidence that you bit me. See the, the mark on my hand? Now I can press charges. There's no mark on your hand. Yeah, I know for a fact there's no mark on There's a mark. You're going to go to jail. And you know that here in Polk County, they pro everybody that goes to jail here, <laughs> they promise you, if you get, oh, I don't know, I, don't know if that, oh, I guess that's a reward for women. Because the sheriff promises you, if you go to jail in this county, they're going to find you a husband in jail. I promise you, if you break the law in my county, we're going to find you a husband in jail. That's going to be the most manly woman ever. I'm sorry, I'm confused. <laughs> No would park in my car. Was it a burp? I blame my burp on you, but then you said it wasn't a burp, so now I'm confused. <laughs> Good. Now I don't know what to do. <laughs> we should ask the local residents, right residents, residents, how they feel about their safety. Do you feel like you're safe here in Polk County? Now, I would go around asking people that. The problem is, I'm afraid they'd steal my camera. <laughs> is that an iPhone? Thump. <laughs> oh, County. We're gonna poke you. Oh, yeah. Poke you. Oh, yeah. Poke, 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 poke you. We're gonna poke you. Poke County. We're gonna poke you. Poke you. We're gonna poke you. Oh, yeah. We're gonna poke you. I'm not trying to make it sound vulgar, but it just came out yogurt. Vote vulgar. Vote vulgarian. That's not the right word. <sighs> well, I haven't seen anything illegal take place while we're getting here. Other than defamation, but. I 
accent have normal as you? Mm. Oh look, Grady Judge. Where, oh, is that the police department? Yeah, cool. police department. Lakeland Police Department. That guy's like the most entertaining person on TV right now. He is. I like when he goes, we're going to find you a husband in the county jail. We're waiting for a train to pass. I don't know how long it's going to take. I like trains. You like you imagine trains? like you call the cops and like, we'll be there in five minutes and look out the window. Oh, give me about 45 minutes. There's a train passing. <laughs> you can't have a train right run past the train. Can you imagine that? There better be a short train. It's already done. Maybe they have a tunnel to go underneath. Police tunnel to go underneath the entrance. Uh, All right, man. Huh? Slow down with the door down. Did you use GPS what I asked you to do? Where'd you at? You, you like an hour ago. Juanetta. Hello. I'm, I've been driving around for half an hour thinking that you GPS the place. And you haven't done it yet? Because you asked me to GPS 50 different no, places. No, I've asked you to go to Walmart. If you exactly don't know how to listen, understand. learn how to listen. In 1,000 feet, turn left onto East Orange Street. You told me you wanted to go to I also asked you to make sure you didn't end up on a tow route, but you didn't look at the map. You have a hearing aid problem. Maybe it's your hearing aid. Maybe it's you. You're going to ask you to make sure we didn't end up on a, on a tow road? Mm-hmm. But you got you on a tow road because you have a hearing aid problem? That's right. south on North Massachusetts Avenue toward East Main Street. Maybe you have a hearing aid problem. Maybe you're the one with the hearing aid problem. Go ahead, swing, women. In 800 feet, turn left onto East I'm Orange Street. For what? Domestic disturbance. For what? Holding your hand? No. They, they, they know you hit me. I don't hit you. Yeah, you hit me all the time. No, no. Patting me is not going to make it Turn left onto East Orange Street. The damage is already done. What are you talking about, Jose? Yeah, yeah, damage is already done. Mm-hmm. Sure. You know what I don't like about the city? What? The center of the city has all these big buildings. Mm -hmm. Like a downtown. But then they have a grid pattern for it. So it's like really like an eyesore of a downtown. Mm -hmm. I think what they need to do here is they need to close off some of the middle streets and make them into like like one maybe like one ways. I mean, if they don't go with a one-way, but if I, if they at least close off some of the intersections, mm -hmm. so it's not stop sign, stop sign, stop sign, stop sign. Yeah. Like, they just need to, like, close off several of these streets. Yeah. And, like, and instead of being roads across, just maybe, like, little parts in the middle or something with pavers. Because, mm -hmm. look, it's like a giant grid pattern. But it's a grid pattern of commercial buildings. It's very ineffective. If the city of Lakeland needs to hire an engineer to kind of redo this city and make it make sense, how about your boy, man? I'm a high school dropout. I finished the ninth. I didn't finish the ninth grade. I started ninth grade. Three times. So I finished middle school. Yeah. So if you guys need a, a engineer to finish this town off, call someone you? else. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't ruin my commercial. I'm trying to pitch some game at these people. Okay, look at these palm trees. I've never seen these palm trees. Beautiful. Like I was saying before Katie d defamed my uh, <laughs> camera, before this defamation, why don't you just shut up for a minute, okay? I'm trying to make some money here. You're the one who's going to spend it. Um, if y'all ever need an engineer, call Jose. Yeah, holla at your boy. Um, I'll decide which streets we're going to close. I need a new wardrobe. Quiet, man. They're gonna think I'm not dressing you right. Just shut up. <laughs> if you need, um, you know, holla at your boy, you know. 
uh, when I was in the eighth grade, I used to draw stuff. So I'll draw up a whole city plan. I'll close off some of these streets. Um, we'll close some of these streets in downtown. Um, and that way traffic can flow more fluently to the city, which will bring more tourism and will make people want to go to downtown more because right now your downtown is a grid pattern of commercial buildings. It doesn't make any sense. So if you work for the city of, of, uh, of Lakeland and you need an engineer to draw up some new city plans, 20, 30 stacks, you heard me? Cash money, because I'm trying to pay taxes on it. What? Don't come at me with a check or nothing like that. Cash money, give me 20 stacks. I'll draw up some new city plans. Um, can't do it like that? I don't think so. <laughs> they have to write a check? Yes. All right, you have to write a check, he says. And then I will make sure the taxes get paid on it, because I handle our finances. That's why we're always broke. Actually, no. Oh crap, we're like, we're in what? trouble. What she doing, man? We're blocking in like, the car behind us did the same thing, okay. Okay. Uh, well, I can't find from the semi, can I? Well, you just uh, did. Okay. Oh wow, this is steep. Yeah. Okay. So like I was saying, uh, you know, I'll, I'll draw up some city plans, we'll close some streets. The streets that we're gonna close, we're gonna put pavers so that they can be walking areas. Um, so that you know the city can have more green spaces for people to walk on a sunny day between commercial buildings it's all right here in my head like I can see Lakeland really benefiting from some civil engineers um, now I would recommend hiring a civil engineer that knows what the crap they're doing but if y'all ain't got enough money for that just let me know and I'll do it for you I, I've always wanted to be a civil engineer and even though I only made it to the eighth grade I can still provide you with that service. No, I'm not gonna tell you it's professional. <laughs> Watch like the whole city bottleneck somewhere else. <laughs> like three years down the road, three years down the line, like Lakeland's like all bottlenecked. <laughs> like, well, they hired an eighth grade dropout to drop. <laughs> okay, this makes no sense. Look at the map. Right here. Look at the map. Look at the map. Yeah. The map says we can drive right through this apartment, through these mobile homes. <laughs> What the crap was that? I don't know. The map thought we could just drive straight to this mobile home. Look at it. <laughs> it still Maybe. thinks we could drive straight through. Turn left. The map's like, you can just drive right through this oh, mobile yeah. home. Oh, yeah. If, oh, you forget the car accident. Yeah. In 800 feet. Just drive Turn straight right. I knew that through. didn't make sense. I, I see where the GPS was taken. I was like, this doesn't make no sense at all. There's an actual line through the house. It's, it's, there, it's got a dark. I'm surprised nobody's drawing like somebody like that's not solar. <laughs> just plow through that mobile home right there. I know. I was like, this doesn't make a lot of sense. Like, the whole time we're going through him, like, this doesn't make sense. Why is Siri making me go through here? <laughs> Turn right. Turn right. Yeah. Turn left. Turn right, Jose. I'll keep going. Fiesta factory. Okay. This is more boring than Montgomery, Alabama. I know, right? What a boring town. Yeah, that's... <sighs> Just boring. That could be a really nice motel. For bed bugs, but yeah. <laughs> so that's a very nice motel for a bed bug. Like you guys said, this was a really nice motel on the head. I'm like, yes, for bed bugs. It's not nice for a human. It's nice it's for a bed not bug. It's nice for you. It's nice for the bed bug. Like it's, it's nice for the bed bug. It's not nice for you. It's more like bed bug nice. It's nice for the bed bug. They like. They bite. You come. They like. They like your. You have good skin. And they also like when you bring food. The bed bug like my whole no, mm -hmm. The bed bug is very happy bed bug. Yeah, some of those it looks like there's more than just bed bug there. You got other types of bugs and other things too. This has been like the most boring road trip we've ever had. I know. Would you agree with me? Yeah. This whole like whole kind of thing's been boring. 
book honey is boring. boring. For real, bro. I um, wish there was some crap so we could have something to watch. I know, right? I guess he's this doing is a real good job. This is about as boring as Montgomery. Yeah. We did spend a day in St. Pete, so it's going to seem like this is more than a thing in St. Pete. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, coconut trees this far inland, this far north? Apparently. That's crazy. Apparently. Mm. Yeah. Apparently. Tire shops and stuff. That's usually a sign of a very nice neighborhood. You know, a thousand tire shops. Oh, my and B factory outlets. Chicken. Is that a geo mushroom? Yeah. This guy's got to have at least four hundred thousand dollars in the bank. He's been saving gas, car, shame. <laughs> a bunch of warehouses on the outskirts of the city. That's about the only thing the city's got going for is good warehouse work. Mm -hmm. Good work in a warehouse. Yeah. That's a single. Room. Three percent. Wow, no phone saying you throughout the whole city. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's time for investment, eh? Hey. part of the city looks worse. I know, right? I, you can't even tell where the hood is. It? The whole thing's like all run down. The whole thing is hood. Dang it, Pizza Hut. <laughs> this Pizza Hut and Travel has been texting Katie like, we miss your business ever since you lose. I went there once. Ever since you move away, we lose 25% of our customer base. And I only ordered from them One once. Time they've been there stop texting about persistent like we know you like pizza Katie Katie we know you like pizza we know you like this reminds me of living in Montgomery it's a lot boring yeah the taco trucks are right what were you thinking good this city's got going for it is a lot of work. Yeah. Compared to other places in Florida. Definitely. And probably affordable housing. Probably. It was really affordable like compared to other places. Maybe we should look at it. No. For this, no. <laughs> this video we might want to look and never come through here again. <laughs> Got that crap metal down there. Going through hard times, steal a barbecue and bring it to us. We'll make your life even harder than what it already is. We knew your life was hard when you started picking up scrap metal. Make it worse. You got a video player internet? That dude. Oh, this looks cool. Let's go here. Yeah. 
Yeah. Like Sonera. I saw Sonera here. Nobody's here though. Yeah. Mi rumba. Is it like the Tampa Day Soleras or is it like a different one? No, it's Puerto Rican. Mm. I thought the Tampa Day Soleras was Puerto Rican. No, I thought the it was Cuban. Cuban. I'm not sure. La La Soleras. Sounds like la El Raptor. Station of the Alright, they get the service. Yeah. Mom Roomba or Eminem Roomba? Eminem. Eminem. So, and the light, if this, this would be a great cover photo if the sun wasn't facing us. Yeah. I thought that Sonetta was for Cuban, though, man. Look at a different room. Crap metal down there. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take six hours to get to seven now. Seven or eight, ten. I thought this region of the state had good phones in there. I did too. Now to get a signal, we had to go anywhere but Florida. Do yeah, those places in Florida, Orlando and Jacksonville have good signal? Yeah, they do. Some parts of Broward. Miami's good. It's not incredible, but it's good. Yeah. Panama City Beach is alright. Yeah. Actually, along the coast is pretty good. The Panhandle Coast. Tampa. It's not even 5G. Tampa has a incredible. few places that are good. I wouldn't say the whole Tampa, but there's like specific yeah. places in Tampa that are good. Good luck with that one. What happened to my drink? my Starbucks. You know I don't drink that. Does that smell like mullet? I don't like it. So that's why I get the brown sugar oat. Now we're like on the far east side of Lakeland. Hands work very hard. Kind of more rural and swampy looking. Dumping! Dumping. Oh, that's because people are picking up the garbage. This looks nice. There's more country out here. Kind of looks run down and dumpy out here. This whole area is like really run down, dumpy looking. Scrap mm. yards and mall home parks. And... I'm bored. Yeah, this has been a really You know it's bad when people have like all these tall fences? Yeah. It means like anything that doesn't have a fence around it gets disappeared. Mm -hmm. Are we still in the Lake Lanier? Cossethville. Cossethville. A little town outside of Lake Yeah. Oh yeah. Licka and foo. Licka foo, licka foo, licka foo. Old Dixie Highway. Oh wow. I had no idea how old Dixie Highway. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, we're 12 minutes from uh, winter. Chicken. Dang old trailer look like it snapped in half right yeah. there. Kind of looks country out here. Yeah. I love these little country towns, man. See, I like this little country town, it's little old houses, little no shotgun front porches. Yeah. Okay, guys, that's it. <laughs>